Hello YouTube, this is Spencer with GouldArrow.com. Uh, just going to be going over some pointers or some findings I had with Rhino 8. I just recently upgraded to that. Uh, the sale does end tomorrow on 227. But uh, I did have a challenge when I upgraded to it with my Space Mouse. I have a 3D connection, Space Navigator, the little hockey puck style thing. If you're interested in those, uh, check the link below. Um, they make a very good product for CAD work. Anyway, uh, Rhino 5 is my, uh, right here shown on the screen, has been my mainstay uh, CAD software for going on almost 10 years now. And just showing you a project in here, this is a 3D printed battery tray for some Bauer batteries. Uh, that was on a previous video. But the Space Mouse works like it's supposed to in all directions. And when I downloaded Rhino 8, it everything was running backwards and I could not get any um, could not make it work and all that stuff reached out to McNeil they sent me a help page which basically tells you to go to options and it comes up and then it goes to the 3d connection space mouse and it says just use their thing to configure it so there's nothing internal here that will help with Rhino end of the day it is a space mouse driver uh, deal it has really nothing to do with 8 so much but uh, you do have to download the latest uh, version of the space mouse driver to even get it to work because without it like if it's too old Rhino even won't recognize that you have a space mouse uh, but when you go to the driver here's the 3d connection driver and it's coming up here so right here it says just um, pretty blank looking then I go to advanced settings it says start menu experience host but if I go over here to Rhino you see once I start moving around in Rhino then it recognizes that's what you're wanting to do with it and there's an option to um, restore defaults there was like lock horizon which wouldn't make it move around correctly so I unselected that and speed but the trick is uh, you gotta have this driver software up and Rhino 8 up move the space mouse move like the web wheel or something like that it'll detect it and then it'll start working correctly and that's basically the fix I found so if you're you know got 8 Rhino 8 and you got the space mouse and everything's going backwards then give this a try and, and hopefully I'll get that working for you a Rhino's off, awesome software for those who have maybe not have seen it or are interested in it. It's uh, very powerful, a really good a menu selections, all that stuff, and you can basically create all kinds of things with it: architecture, marine, aerospace, all kinds of various things. You can make models for 3D printing, and hopefully, this information will help you with uh, your Rhino 8 install and hopefully if you like the video like and subscribe thanks